setting your alignment. This is your origin and your position. This is the origin for your Z and your X and Y. All right. So first step is turn on your machine. If it's on, turn it off, then back on. You'll see it say grab a graph here. All right. When it says grab a graph on the display, it might be easier if I go that. You'll see it say grab a graph on the X display, and then you want to hit the X button on your keyboard here. All right, once you're in the X menu, you'll get four options. You want to scroll down to where it says realign machine. All right, and hit check. All right, so first we'll go through the realign XY. All right, so hit, go to realign XY, hit check. Your laser is going to go home if it isn't. Actually, it'll go home regardless. At this point, you can lift the cover. All right. So the, the goal for the realign X, Y is, see the little red light here? This is your pointer laser. And you'll see a divot. It's kind of hard to see here, but you'll see a divot in your rulers. And the goal is to get use the arrow keys and get it exactly centered on the divot. All right, once you have it exactly centered on the divot, press and hold check. It'll beep, do a little bit of a homing thing, and then it'll go back to the, the realignment menu. All right, next, next is realign Z. All right, it'll, it's right below the realign XY in the alignment menu. All right, so you go to realign Z and hit check. So what it's doing here is, it comes out to the center, and it, it came up, if you'll notice it hit the black sensor, that, that, that just tells it where it is, and then it comes down off that sensor a set amount. Your display right now will say 0 0.787, uh, if you can read that, it'll say realign Z, joystick Z, 0 0.787, alright, so, Where's your focal tube go? Ah, there it is. Here's our focal tube. So what you'll need is one of these. This is a two-inch focal tube. This goes with the two-inch lens, focal lens. And what you do? So you're gonna you're gonna have a lot of room initially at the 0 0.787. See the the gap in there? Alright? So you start using the up arrow. Set it beside the side. Use the up arrow, and the goal is to get it to where you have a little bit of clearance on the blue focal tube. Can y'all see with that? All right. See how it's closing the gap there with the lens. So you want to get it to where. Now tension when you're sliding it in and out. Alright. Too much. Basically you want to make it scrape but not get stuck. Yeah. So when you're putting it in there with your fingers, a nice easy way to say it is, can you move it all the way through or can you not? Essentially when you get to the center, when your focal tube and your lens match up, it should scrape hard enough that it basically gets stuck. Okay? Alright. Okay. So, once you've done that, you have to absolutely make sure you take this out. You have to make sure you take this out. If you don't take it out, the next thing you're going to do is hit check. Press and hold check. If you do that with it in there, it will come up and hit the lens assembly. So, very important that you take this out of there before you hit check. Then it'll go back to home, and that's how you rely on the X, Y, and Z.